this week's adventure is very adventurous. We were making this big week long trip to Florida and then our dog decided that he hated our house sitter. So we kind of had to rearrange. We're actually going to Florida separately. Yeah, I think it'll be like, I get, I'll get to the airport and fly out and then like an hour later she lands. Yeah, we're, <laughs> yeah, we're kind of gonna like pass each other in the air. It is Wednesday morning, and Rambo is so sweet. All right, I am at the airport here. So I had to park out the second level because it is crowded in at the airport here. Uh, anyways, I'm gonna head in and hopefully make it to Florida safely. Walking over, I got my car from Enterprise, and I am gonna pick up my car now. Just landed, and then I'm gonna go over to my folks' house. Okay, bye. <laughs> all right, so I got a selection of all these cars here. Right, I I'm totally gonna do the. Uh, I'm gonna do the blue one. I don't know how to do this. Oh, oh yeah, I just opened up the car and like it's in here and uh, I got myself a, uh, a spark and it's blue. It's basically like a motorcycle. Man, I'm tired. Okay, well, I'm in the car. Here we go. Let's do this thing. Hi friends. Welcome back to And the Adventure Continues. This is part two of our vacation adventure. So if you haven't watched part one yet, be sure you go back and see that. I got home from my part of the vacation last night and today I was kind of cleaning and unpacking and I was looking around our bedroom and y'all, our bedroom is pitiful. And I know that it stresses my husband out. He really liked it to be nicer and just a place to relax. So I have, today's Thursday, I don't pick Josh up from the airport until like midnight on Saturday, or I guess Sunday morning, technically. So I've got a good chunk of time. I am going to paint our bedroom, and we have like dressers um, that we never really finished properly. So I'm gonna paint all of those, I'm gonna paint our room, I'm going to buy us matching laundry hampers and a bedspread so that everything is kind of cohesive and try to have it looking nicer and a little bit more relaxing for my sweet husband when he gets back. So let's go on my part of the adventure and I'll try to plug in part of Josh's adventure while he's in Florida too as we go. All right, so it is, uh, what, what is it, what, Thursday? I don't even know what day it is. I just had some coffee, had some great conversations with my folks. Um, I gotta make my bed. Yeah, I'm looking forward to today and I think my nephew's coming over and I'm gonna help him out with his car. And uh, other than that, I gotta shower and I'll see you later. I'm gonna go ahead and prime my door because it's this really nasty dark stain. I wanna at least get that primed and I'll buy this special door paint. At Lowe's too, I'll just get Lowe's on my money basically. Um, but yeah, my ultimate goal for today, I'm gonna finish the door, um, I'm going to paint that little section of ceiling, and then I'm gonna shower because I am disgusting and sore. Um, and then I'll call it a day. See the ceiling. They didn't do it right when they sprayed the popcorn, so little by little, all the popcorn's letting go, which is fine because I want it to go anyway. But all right, I'm out here with my nephew's car and we are doing the big three upgrade, which is you're putting a bigger uh, alternator cable on, negative and a body or uh, engine to a body connection for the ground. And so they're just a little bit thicker wires. And so we're gonna put that on there. We just gotta watch out for the rain 
and then that's what we're gonna do. So there's like tired and then there's exhausted. What comes after that? I'm that. I got almost the entire bedroom painted. I got the door primed and I got the ceiling primed. So first thing tomorrow morning, I'm going to Lowe's for paint. Good night. <laughs> Just got breakfast with my folks and we're heading back to the house. And so we're just driving down the road. There's a lot of traffic, but this is normal. <laughs> Good morning. It's Friday morning. It's eight in the morning. And now I'm going to Lowe's with no makeup on and that's okay. <laughs> so anyways, I'm heading out to Lowe's. I'm gonna get that paint that I need and then hopefully finish painting that wall, the last wall and then go to my hair appointment. I'll try to clean myself up a little bit before then. <laughs> Let's go Lowe's. All right, so we are going to travel a little bit. I mean, we're gonna drive down and check out to see how uh, different the, the old stopping grounds are. There we go. All right, so this is a, a church that uh, Sarah and I, we were at um, a concert for, a, I think it's a band called like Fire, Fireflies or something like that. But Sarah and I had a little table up here for the college we were working at and we worked this together and this was before we were married or anything like that. So uh, anyways, this is the church over here in Tarpon. wall. Let's do this. All the walls are officially painted. Yes. So excited. Goal accomplished. So I have to go get ready to go to the hairdresser now. I wish I could just keep going, but I can't go to a hair salon looking like this. My goal is to get the furniture all painted today and hopefully the door. Tomorrow is kind of going to be my decorating day. I want to find a headboard. I want to find new laundry hampers that match and I want to get the artwork up on the walls. So and then Josh will come home that night. This time is going by super, super fast. Haircut complete. I picked myself up a protein shake for lunch so that I can just suck this down and get right back to painting. I've got a lot of work left to do this afternoon and evening, but I think I can get it done. Lunch and then back to work. <laughs> Behind me is the uh, boats that they use to uh, collect the sponges. So this right here, this is a school that Sarah worked at a long time ago. We first got married, and so she taught uh, third grade, and then she got and taught, uh, you know, middle school and high school English. And so this is where it's at. And now we are heading back. Here we go. So it's five o'clock, and everything officially has its first coat. Yes, 
I'm gonna kind of do some of the shopping I was gonna do tomorrow. I'm gonna go ahead and get that knocked out this evening while these are waiting their eight hours and then at 10 o'clock tonight, I'll go on ahead and do the second coat. I'm crazy. <laughs> So it's 9.17 and I was going to do a second coat at 10, but there's no way. I went to one, two, three, four different stores tonight trying to find a headboard. Nobody has them. The lady at Haverty's literally laughed at me and told me it took 16 weeks to get just a basic headboard in. That's crazy. So I don't know what I'm gonna do. So we'll see. Until tomorrow, good night. Publix, gonna go in, get some breakfast, and bring it back to the house. Good morning! It's Saturday morning. I get to see Joshua tonight. Um, so I woke up super early. Uh, I got the second coat I just finished on all of the dressers and drawers and the whole nine yards. And praise God, I found a headboard. I went to, like I said, four different stores yesterday evening. I could not find a thing. So I looked on Facebook Marketplace and I found several. And then I've got to clean up a little bit because I can't go in public looking like this. And then, I've got to go get the headboard and go grocery shopping. Ah, uh, it's going to be a busy Saturday. Can we please discuss that Chick-fil-A delivery is like the best invention in the history of inventions. Out with the brown. And in with the... Matchy matchy. <sighs> okay, so Josh just texted me and he's at the airport. It is now 419. I ran into a small snafu with the headboard. I'm pretty sure it's not a straight king. I think it's a California king, which means it's a little bit too big for our bed frame. So I spent like 45 minutes in Lowe's looking at tons of different hardware, and I think I've come up with something that should still make it work. I think it's plain, as long as it's on time, it comes in at like 11.33 or something random. So let's see how much I can get done in a fast amount of time. All right, I just dropped off my car. My this mask is all wonky. Anyways, you just pull up in this line and then uh, someone checks out your car and you're done. It takes like five seconds. So definitely if you're renting a car from the airport here at Tampa International Airport, like, man, they're, Super efficient, in my opinion, in my experience. This is the longest escalator I've literally seen. I think it's a three-story escalator. Anyways, I'm gonna go to the uh, terminals. I'm gonna try to find my my gate and then uh, hang out until I need the board. All right, so right now I'm gonna get some Panda Express. 
Got some mushroom chicken and I'm uh, gonna try to eat that. My flight's delayed a bit, so I'll, uh, yeah, anyway, just gonna eat some uh, an early dinner and then wait for the flight for a couple hours. So I'm still waiting for the plane that's somewhat uh, delayed. And so then I got some uh, two books. Uh, looks like I got my uh, flights delayed again, just by a little bit. Uh, we'll see what happens with that. Right now I've landed over in uh, Columbia, or I'm in Atlanta. I've got to find, so the Atlanta airport's pretty huge. So I'm gonna find the underground tunnel thing. And then I'm gonna go to um, uh, Columbia. So. In order to get from uh, each terminal, I have this uh, subway. and it's done and I'm actually gonna get in the shower and clean up and go get my husband um, but let me kind of show you how the room turned out this isn't a better homes and gardens type of makeover guys the bedroom was just really bad before and now I feel like it looks better and hopefully it's a little bit more peaceful and calming and hopefully he'll enjoy it obviously the dog bed still looks a little rough <laughs> but Rambo's happy Josh hated his nightstand, so he's been asking for shelves, which I gave him. Got a new bedspread. We got matching cubes. Cleared off a bunch of crud that was everywhere. My bathroom is still a mess. Painted the dressers. Everything's uniform. Actually have artwork on the wall. Bicycles and skateboards for Josh. And then an ice skating patent for me, because that's what I used to be into back in the day. And laundry hampers. Not exciting, but at least they match now. So, that's our space. It's that time. Let's go get Josh. Home and see your dog. I miss my dog. <laughs> Are you ready to go home and see your surprise? What is it? It's a surprise. I have been filming it. So I gotta like it regardless. Mm, maybe a little bit. Let's go home. It's 12:30. It looks really good. <laughs> you got new ones of those. Mm -hmm, they oh, all match. Them up. They all match. Wow, man, yeah, it's so nice. I got you shelves because you've always hated your nightstand. <laughs> this adventure's done. I'm tired. It was a very exhausting one. Until next time, the adventure continues. Bye. Yeah.